هلو هلو هاي نادا كيفك؟ كيفك علي اخبارك؟ ماشي الحال مشتاقين كيفك انت؟ انا اكثر والاحمر كيفك انت استاذ؟ اول جود كيف احمد احسن؟ والله الحمد لله احسن دحين انت كيفك؟ اول جود الحمد لله ثانك يو لونج تايم لونج تايم يس ثانك يو سو ماتش جود تو سي يو فريندز ان يوروب بيكوز يو هاف جريت ويذر عندكم الطقس كثير حلو فاحنا حاسبينكم على هذا الشيء يلا هوبفلي وي سي يو سون وانس فبيسكلي علي انا قاعد عن نبوما انا قاعد اقول لهم انه انت رجال مجوهرات سنين كثيره ف وانت تكلم مو اللي اكثر عنك عن نبوما كم سنه صار لك المجوهرات كيف دخلت في المجال a bit more about حق العيله حقتك and your family business فخليني اتعرف عليك اكثر Okay. I want to start with the checkerik for your time and for the opportunity to being on uh, this show. Like I said, the Shark Al Ousat is a great honor. I mean, from a family and from a personal and friendship standpoint, and from a family and from a personal and friendship standpoint, and from a family and from a personal and friendship standpoint, and from a family and from a personal and friendship standpoint, Exactly. Like I said, I'm a fifth generation diamanteur, meaning Tejer Olmaz. This is a business that my family started uh, over 100 years ago, meaning from the time of the year, in the dealing in uh, rock diamonds. And then we expanded uh, internationally uh, over the years. So here, Levuma today is active in every step of the value chain of a diamond, meaning from Manajem Olmaz, who is the Khrijil Olmaz. لحك الالماز اللي هو دايموند كاتينج ل اوبسلي مباع البوليش دايموندز اللي هو هول سيلينج تو براندز اند شوبس جلوبالي اند ان لاست ديكيد وي ستارت دوينج جوالريز از ويل تو كيتر تو برايفت كونسيومرز اللي هو مجوهرات على الطلب اللي ويتش از بيسبوك جوالري اللي وي سي فروم اور اند لايك از the ultimate luxury in a way because every client can put his own creativity, his own uh, uh, self in the piece. Exactly, literally anything. Yani we have a team that can create any piece. <laughs> exactly. And actually, before doing this, Mitlik Inte, I worked in finance for 10 years. And I used to multitask. When I was in finance, I used to live in London and uh, work in American investment banks. And a few years ago, I decided to fully focus myself on Al Maz, which is uh, what I love. Yeah. Uh, I remember when I met Ali, I met him in Gestad. He was the first time I met in London. He was واحدة صديقة لي عرسها كان هي عندها ستون وهو هي بس كانت تبغى الستون يبان وعلي سمعها على طول نايس زيارة اللي هو كاش بسيط لعرسها وبعدين كمان لما كنا في الثاني ثاني برضه كعامل طقم جدا حلو مرسوم اظن من الاونر اظن كانوا هم راسمين الفكرة مظبوط وكان اللي حلو في الفكرة انه هو الفوكس والتركيز كان كله على الحجر نفسه منه مسحوم بين دايموندز وبين القطع كل قطعه تبان هذا اللي شغلك كان صراحه مزبوط نحن السبيشالتي هي الماز اهم شيء يعني وي تراي تو كيب ذا موديل سيمبل اند كيب ذيم لايك كونتمبوري كلاسيك فور ذا مين فوكس تو بي اون ذا ستون ات سيلف ويتش از ذا بيوتي اوف ذا بيس طيب اوكي اسالك قلت اول شيء هاو ديد يو موف فروم بانكينج تو جولري How did I go from banking to jewelry? Hala, and I did it 10 years in banking, so I learned a kid uh, a lot to Banet Ailaat a week tier. And I used to multitask, and at one point, خلاص, my own company used to take much more time than banking. And I did a lot of what makes more sense to LA, and uh, yeah, what, what I love the most actually. So uh, I decided uh, three years ago to do the move. And uh, here we are. Amazing. Okay, I want to ask, um, I mean, tell us about diamonds. How do you find them? For example, now, there are people who buy the diamonds in a different way. They make them in a different way. How do you, for example, um, what 
البوست من ناحيه البارامترز من ايش اهم شيء راح تركز عليه في الشراء اكيد سو so, هي اول اول شيء بدك تعرفيه بالالماز اهم شيء يو هاف فور بارامترز اللي نحن بنسميهم الفور سيز اللي هن ذا كات اللي هو حجم يعني ذا شيب هلا اي بريبيرد فيو ستونز ذات اي شو يو بس مثلا اوفل راوند بير هارت اند سو فورت عندك ذا كارت اللي هو الوزن ذا ويت بعدين عندك ذا كلر اللي هي اللون ذات جوز للالماز الابيض فروم دي تو زد دي بينج ذا بيست وهلا عندي كمان الماز ملون بس ويل ديسكاس ات ليتر اون اند ذا فورت وان از ذا كلاريتي اللي هي النضافه ات جوز فروم فلوليس في في اس في اس لا اس اي و اي ويتش از انكلودد سو ذس از ذا فور مين بارامترز بعدين يو هاف مور تكنيكال وانز اللي هن الفلوريسنس و هاو ذا ستون ات سيلف از كات هل اهم شيء بي سايد فور بارامترز هي اهم شيء الثاني شيء كثير مهم الشهادة So you have different laboratory in the world. The first one is GIA, the Gemological Institute of America, who I am going to say any potential virus of diamond to only buy GIA. I know in the Middle East, in Bactir, HRD, EGL, IGI, there are other laboratories, but that are less strict and less stringent than GIA. And the loan to buy on, if a GIA gives a H color, my only point is that you have F, which is, they're not as strict. GIA is... Hey, this is how a certificate of GIA looks, by the way. Okay. And every single parameter we we can make two draw, and whether the shape, the color, the clarity, the fluorescence, and so forth. So, this is one of the most important points about diamonds. So. This is the four categories: parameter, the loan, the weather. الحجر النظافه ايوه اند كات يا اند كات طيب مثلا هاو دوز ذا برايس كيف الاسعار تختلف من الكواليتيز من النوعيه اند وات ايش تنصح مثلا اول شخص يبغى يشتري ذا يا ما عنده بادجت ايش اللون اللي يشتري يشتري كلاسيك يشتري ايش تنصح Okay, هلا أول شيء على ال difference بس لا تعرفي هلا أكيد the price of a diamond exponential. شو معناتها هلا إذا بتغلي مثلاً 10 كارات D flawless ما راح يكون سعرها the price of 10 times a 1 كارات D flawless. يعني the 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 price itself is exponential. مثلاً 10 كارات D flawless سعرها ممكن يكون فوق المليون. و 1 كارات D flawless سعرها يكون 10000 تقريباً. So you see there's quite a big difference. Hey, well, she. In terms of size, you have the bigger, obviously, the higher the price. It's exponential, man. A linear correlation. But then the kill, the way we are selling the gems, I mean, in in the dealer market, is we take the four C's that I mentioned in consideration: the loan, the weather, the clarity, and and the shape. And then sell the gems. I mean, for example, HVS1 is going to be obviously more expensive than HVS2. And we have a grid that is published weekly that we are in the wholesale market. So, for example, a five-carat HVS2 round would cost, let's say, a hundred thousand, give or take. With five-carat D flawless, sell it for four hundred thousand. So, there is a big difference between loan and loan. Hello, the one who has a budget limit. What I would recommend. It's something very personal, uh, and every culture has different ways of seeing it. Hello, Fahim Kif. But for example, if a person comes to me and has a limited budget to buy a shirt for an engagement ring, I would, and I like the stone in the bag. I'm not going to be very clear or extravagant. So, and if someone has a limited budget, before they take, for example, a stone of one carat D flawless. فدلوا لا يأخذ لون أوتا and a lower clarity for an engagement ring مثلاً I would say we can go to H color by GIA وحتى I if the color is good up to VS2 clarity which I would retain the minimum if it's for an engagement ring هلا مثلاً إذا لا حلا ولا necklace it's not something that you stare at it every single day and that you show to everyone and so forth but it is I would recommend people best la, to maximize the budget and the size عشان حلو كمان شيء يبين to go down up to I and J color by GIA وحتى فيون ينزلوا على SI1 clarity 
if the SI1 is naked, is uh, 100% eye clean. And I said, SI1, sometimes you have a problem Sorry, the inclusion would be in our line from in on if it's a neon neh, maybe by no. So, uh, and that allows the client to maximize the look of uh, the necklace or the ring and so forth. Okay, okay. So, the muhim and we can have the other level of clarity, you can feel the ring enough to occur in the earring. We had if it's a budget. مزبوط هلا على عتيق على عتيق مثلا مثلا باليابان ان جابان اتس توتالي ديفرنت تفكيره اذا عندهم مثلا بادجت معين وسايز معين هن ذا دريدر جو دون ان كلر يعني ما يشروا مثلا دي اي اف حتى المهم الستونز تكون فلولس يعني بينزلوا سمتايمز كان باي كي كلر اللي هو لون وات كثير از لونج از ذا ستون فلولس عشان they're obsessed with perfection and with having no okay. impurities in the stone. بس بالآخر أنا مثلاً I don't like this because بالآخر اللي راح يبين هو اللون. إذا ال stone flawless ولا VS2 على العين ما راح تشوف الشيء. And it's only if you take it ten times magnifier loop. بتشوف which you don't often do. هو أهم شيء كيف يبان على اليد. مزبوط. Okay, قول لنا طبعا I know that you, انت سالك في البزنس فتره طويله انا مثلا في مجال كلوذنج اقدر اقول لك السعوديه يشتروا كذا اهل الكويت كذا يشتروا I know the market in the Gulf more قول لنا كذا I know انت سالك في البزنس for so long قول لنا مثلا what is the Asian market like what is the Saudi market like what is the yeah, okay. give us an idea Lebanon versus what is the most um, يعني انا I know that a lot of people are all about كم ديرات مزبوط أنا أعرف بنات الحجر حقهم ما يمكن ما يبان حجر باين سوارفسكي لأنه لازم الخاتم قد يدها. مضبوط. فـ I want to know منك أنت إيش بتلاحظ أكثر شيء مثلا كتباع مثلا الخليج what do they look at carrots or هلا بالخليج to be honest is mostly uh, size they can go down to H, I and J color by G, I, A بس إنه people like having a big stone a big, a big, يعني. a big, uh, a big ring. So, Bled uh, Arabi, I would say they're more, all similar. They compromise on color and clarity as long as the habit is and uh, it's big. This is the Middle East. Middle East. Hala, bil, uh, Yaban, they, they're obsessed with perfection. So sometimes they, uh, they should be flawless and very small stones la, just because they want it to be perfect. Perfect. For example, uh, you have a mix, but usually they're obsessed with high quality and colored diamonds. And in line, uh, the scene is a uh, uh, market for pink, blue, and uh, orange diamonds. But then we will talk about the topic because it's important. In America, we also want to add a lot of color, and the color that we use in America is a lot. And the color is also another color. The color we have in the Arab world actually is, is very subtle as well, and it's actually beautiful. In America, they like princess cuts, which we, we don't usually sell in the Middle East. They like different type of uh, stones, and they go down to SI2, I1. Mohem, habit kun bi lektir, u babte from al nadaf. Hey, tamt alik. Dahin, I want to ask you. Dahin, is anta andak budget kabir, and hat shteri stone. Anta khat. Ish el stone el shteri? Ish el size? Ish el size? Stone shteri. يعني احنا بنتكلم دحين كده بيكوز انت عارف ناو وي ار ان فيز ان اوت اوف بيبل وفي انفسترز اوف كورس يشتروا دحين مجوهرات كاوي تو انفست يعني مو بس صارت انه اشتري من الطقم او مجوهرات عشان لكجري ناو ذس از ان انفستمنت فكثير ناس بيتابعونا يمكن يشوفوا هذا الموضوع انه ذس از لكجري وير تايم اوف كوفيد بس ذس از اكشلي ان انفستمنت اوبورتونيتي مضبوط اكشلي السؤال كثير مهم ومعك حق ونحن اكشلي ان لاست تو مانث كل شغل بي تو بي كان موقف بس الشغل مع البرايفتس والانفسترز هاد بيك اب دراماتيكلي اي طبعا عشان ذيرز تو اوبورتونيتيز هلا بالماركت اف سمون از لوكينج فور انفست اول شيء اللي عم بيصير هلا بالعالم وبالدايموند ماركت از انبريسيدنتد يعني اتس سمثينغ وي نيفر هاد بيفور مع كورونا كرايسيس اللي صار نحن من اوائل السنه بلشت تتسكر ايجيا هلا مثل ما قلت لك ايجيا اليابان والصين هن اكثر شيء بيشتروا دي فلوليس دايموندز اللي هي احسن نوعيه الماز ابيض. اللي صار تسكر تسكر كل شيء هونيك حتى ذا شيبينج كمباني سو البزنس كله على هالمنطقه كلها وقف. ات ذا سيم تايم عندك ماينز بافريقيا وببلاد ثانيه ذات هاد تو كونتينيو تو برودوس. ليه؟ عشان ذي هاف اوبريشنال كوست، ذي هاف ليفرج، ذي هاف ديت، 
لازم ي... they need to produce and they need to pay the operational costs. So تروا يبيعوا رف شو صار؟ السعر الأرماز دي فلولس نزل. وعادة in times of crisis ما بينزل ما بينزل يعني بتطلع على 2002 2008 سوري و 1987 آخر two big crises الدي فلولس سعرهم طلع. هي أول مرة بشوف السعر ينزل هالقد يعني صرنا in a level Uh, of the 2006 period to 2012, I'm talking 20 to 30 uh, percent yeah. declining price for the flawlesses. Uh, only. The so. The hab tola kam? The hab tola mnih tola from 1400 to 1800 in kam yom. So, the uh, see just the, the reason is that much can fee everything was locked and the mines continue to produce. Once things reopen, we will uh, see the market renormalizing. So, Kadi Flawless, seeing the price at where it used to be 10 years ago, it's an amazing opportunity. مرة هي أول نوعية ألماز، ثاني نوعية ألماز هي ألماز الزاهر، بينك دايموندز. كإنفستمنت إتس أي كان ستريس هاو ماتش، أي مين ذيرز إتس ون أوف ذا بيست تونز تو باي أت ذا مومنت. الريزن إز أسعارها ما نزلت، يعني حتى هلا مع كورونا أسعارها بعدها مثل ما هي، بس اللي عم يصير عندك ماين أستراليا اللي اسمها أرجايل ماين. اللي هي بتصدف 90% من الماز الزاهر بالعالم is closing down next year يعني it's been a mine سلون سلا فوق ال 40 40 50 سنه عم بيستخرجوا الماز منه and the mine is depleted so you have the biggest mine of the world of pink diamonds that's closing down next year and you have demand that keeps on increasing because عندك اكيد emerging middle class upper class more wealth in general in the world And it's becoming extremely rare. So, so the كل ما بيصير كل ما بيصير rare كل ما يصير السعر يزيد ويعلى ويصير more of an investment opportunity. ويمكن كمان لما المين ده يقف اللي يصير ال opportunity to find the quality is much less than before. أيوه. مزبوط. لعطيك فكرة الألماز الزاهر in the last 10 years went between two times to six times حسب the size or intensity and color and price. واللي هو كمان اكشلي فور اول اذر كلر دايمز از ويل باخر 20 سنه وين بيتوين 10 تو 20 فولدز ويتش اكسيدد يعني اني اذر انفستمنت ان ويذر ستوك ماركت اور اني اذر ريسيرفز سؤال ثاني اي ونتد تو اسك يو البرايسنج اوف اوكي سوري يو جست توكينج اباوت ذا برايسنج اوف دايموند اند هاي كلر دايموندز Does the does the blue diamond uh, have the same weight or heaviness as the pink diamond? نفس الفكرة ولا مو زي ال. لا هن ال weight كله نفس الشيء يعني كل whether the diamond is uh, why in terms of weight carat weight. هلا in terms of uh, كله نفس الشيء uh, بس in, because the carat is uh, a certain number of grams. بس هلا in terms of uh, rarity in color diamond هي the rarest is الماز الأحمر red diamonds. أيوة. لما بتلاقي كثير منهم يعني في يمكن كل سنه يطلع شي 10 حبوب بالعالم كله يعني عم تحكي لايك اتس اكستريملي رير اللي عطيك فكره الالماز الاحمر ذا 1 كارت از 1 مليون دولار اند 1 كارت از ريلي ريلي سمول سمول يا اند اكبر وحده بالعالم كانت 5 كارت انباعت اذا بتذكر منيح فور 25 مليون دولار واو مين؟ انباعت اكشن اي ثينك اف اي ريمبر ويل Oh, بس سو كلر دايموند طبعا اوفر ذا ييرز اه بيكوز اتس بيكمينغ ويل ا كويستشن اي وونت تو اسك يو استخراج الدايموندز ذا مايننج اوف دايموندز هاز ات بيكم هاردر ذان بيفور هل صار استخراج الدايموندز اعلى من اصعب من اول ولا اتس بيكمينغ ايزير يس اند نو هلا اكيد ذا تكنولوجيكال ادفانسمنت هلا احسن سو يو هاف مور ماشينريز اند مور اكويبمنت سو هلا اهيا واحد يستخرج الماز بس اصعب ليه ما ما بيكون في نيو ماينز يعني اول ذا ماينز جلوبالي بافريقيا بكندا ببرازيل بروسيا وباستراليا هاف بين اكسبلورد سو بعد عندك مناطق صغيره وير ذا ماينينج واز ارتيزانال اند اتس موفينج هلا انتو ا لارج سكيل ماينينج 
So the okay. mining, once you dig here, the, uh, the mines usually measure in a cone shape. And a mine looks like this. So uh, the, the deeper you dig, at one point, it's as a cone. You find that the surface below, below. And once you reach uh, the end, it's not a cone. ما في واحدة كانت تسألني في الكوستشنز هنا إنه هل إيش أفضل البلدان لاستخراج الدايموندز وهل جنوب أفريقيا من ضمنها؟ هي أفريقيا أحسن من الماز. هل actually it depends the quality. بس عادة uh, in terms of quality و size أفريقيا أحسن أحسن شيء يعني عندك ويست أفريقيا بس سيراليون عندك أحسن uh, يلو دايموندز بالعالم اللي هي بتجي من منطقة اسمها زيمي. And I had posted something on Instagram a few weeks ago on it that gives you. I have an example to show you later on. But aqua yellow diamond in the world. Le ma bin aran la any other yellow diamond in the world. Hala la pink diamond, for example, ahsan pink, bije min Australia argal mine. But the size won't be too small. I mean, Australia bije kilon between 0.10 carat to 2-3 carat. We kun ma bi kun ondaf kiti. Hala la ahsan pink. وبحجم كبير من تنزانيا in a mine that's called Williamson. مثلا Queen Elizabeth herself has a big pink diamond that's called the Williamson diamond that's quite famous. وللباقي الماز الابيض احسن كواليتي جنوب افريقيا بوتسوانا ليزوتو اهم بلاد. اوكي واي ار كولر دايموند فيري سبيشال؟ از بيكوز اوف ليه انه الماس الملون مره فيه سبيشال ليش مره مهم؟ هل is it because people like it ولا is it because of the price point is it luxurious is it uh, uh, there's not enough it's our sheet it's beautiful and I will show you some example but ma يعني مثل ما قلت لك الريد دايموندز بيطلع فيها 10 stones a year تقريبا 10 to 15 stones maximum وعلى بتحكي stones صغير كثير يعني بس حبه تجي وبدها تنباع you have a few billions people uh, that That could be potential consumers. So, next to Sheila, the Mazel Blue, the Zahir, I mean, you have the whole world competing for this kind of stones, and you have very few of them coming up. He is a bit like the Sheila Mazel Abiyad. Well, the Mazel Abiyad, I mean, the deep flawless that are extremely rare. I mean, between the deep flawless, the Ala Sheila Abiyad, the new one, I'm talking about zero point one percent from all the Mazel Blues in the world. يعني a very small proportion. The bay اللي بيطلع كله very small ولا very low color ولا ما ما بيكون نظيف كتير. And that's why as well the prices command few millions than the Muslim one. Okay, as a jeweler, انت you specify you you work specifically انك انت ايش الدورة كيف انت تحس كيف أول شيء let's talk about you moving from a banker to a jeweler. Yeah. From finance to jewelry, Abaris, what's your role as a jeweler? Is it? Share me. How do you brainstorm? How do you think about the idea? How do you get the stone? Share me. How do you roll in this field? How do you play the role? Aside from the client side, other than the clients. Yeah. How does she roll with the client? Yeah, let's finish if you want with the client. I will see. Much more than here, you always need to have a relationship with the client. Yeah, we, for example, had a fun with a kid's bone. He could be in a relationship, and relationship is not just for a day or two days. It's for the child and the child. I mean, this is a very, very, very important relationship in this business. With every single client, we try to have a relationship, and then we also have a relationship with time, with time. Uh, friendship. So, uh, and obviously, the role of a jeweler is extremely confidential. يعني بالآخر الواحد بس يش أولماز ولا jewelry مجوهرات هي موضوع كتير شخصي. يعني confidentiality is extremely uh, important. We try يعني every time to be as uh, open with the clients, to advise them, to recommend, to, to uh, call them whenever we see an opportunity in the market, and so forth. Another, I have a question here. How, for example, one who has a piece, you want to evaluate, you want to know more about the piece. Do you offer this service? Do you have 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 this service? Do you have
بياكلوا ايه بيقيم سعره هل عندك هذه الخدمه انك تعطيهم تقييم مضبوط على yeah. سعر الاستراتيجيات اللي عندهم؟ اي اكيد يعني وي اولويز وي اولويز هابي يعني تو هيلب كلاينتس نعطيهم فالويشن نعطيهم نصيحه اذا بدهم يبيعوا ولا اذا بدهم ابجريد او اذا بدهم تشينج Uh, بيبنا مفتوح يعني we always open to uh, to help and to give advice يعني حتى sometimes we have clients that call us شيف وشي مكان وبدون الأدفايس تبعنا على الفاليويشن ولا على السعر ولا على الكواليتي ولا if it's a good idea يعني we definitely we do it with our existing clients and uh, and we'll be happy to do it with anyone uh, really لنبني علاقة Uh, شيء ثاني ابى اسالك يا ايش رايك في الالماس الصناعي لاب دايموند وات دو يو ثينك اوف ذس فيلد هلا اتس ا فيري تريندي توبيك ات ذا مومنت بيكوز اتس بين اتس بيكمينج مور اند مور افيلبل بالماركت هلا نحن مثلا ما بنشتغل اكيد بالالماس الاصطناعي اند وي دونت ريلي بليف ان ات اللي هي اللي بدك تعرف فيه هو الالماز يعني لاخر سنتشريز عم تحكي يعني مش بس عن جديد بس من 100 200 300 سنه 400 سنه has always been a surge of value and it's always been uh, something that's passed on يعني من ولد للولد ولا it's always been a, something that has value اللي هو sometimes security لل uh, امراه herself in case she has a divorce ولا security for the kids if God forbid something happens so هي الالماز is just not something only for the look بس هي كمان storage of value اللي هو الالماز الاصطناعي منه هيك شيء يعني it's more fashionable piece و as technology advanced كمان عم ينزل سعره هو منه شيء جديد by the way هي اول ناس اللي عملوا الالماز الاصطناعي was general electrics بالستينات for industrial purposes وهلا اخر سنين you had more companies entering the market و with technology advancement the cost عم يوتا بس بالاخر if you buy this yeah, it's not something that has value it's the same I guess if you buy a real Hermes ولا fake Hermes you know it's uh, it's not resellable ما في value ما في ما في value it's not really resellable يعني حرام الواحد يدفع فيها only if you consider it as a fashion piece بس حتى يعني الواحد إذا عندك شيء إنه usually you want to pass it on to few generations or you want to keep it as a security يعني God forbid لا سمح الله إذا صار شيء Uh, so it's 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 it, dif- it caters to different markets. Okay. Uh, diamonds. What are the countries that produce diamonds around the world? You mentioned so Tanzania, we... Australia, South Africa. Which yeah. So in in Africa, I think Sierra Leone, Congo, Angola, Botswana, Lesotho, Jnub Afrika, and Tanzania. All the main producers. عندك البرازيل اللي هو عادة نوعية واطي بس عندهم ألماز ملون كمان حلو in green diamonds عندك روسيا which is a big producer in Siberia وعندك أستراليا وكندا and that's it the other countries are not considered actually I I got some rough diamonds لفرجيكي كمان تتفكرون I prefer هلا I prefer the few a small collection to show you هلا هل الماز مثلا الماز الخام rough diamonds هيك بيظهر من من المنجم so as you can see it looks like a crystal this is another one وهي بس يطلع هيك نحن وبيجي لنا نحن بتاخذ الواحد بده يدرسها بتاخذ كم يوم ولا كم اشهر حسب Uh, the hajma and if it's complicated and so forth and once we study it uh, we decide how to cut it really هي... نعم. can you can you put it closer كم حجمها تقريبا هذه كم تطلع 21 كارات توتال وهي هي بتطلع هلا نحن حاسبينها انه تطلع تطلع مثلا this side you can see راح تطلع شو نجاسة a pear shape a drop you can see it actually <تصفيق> So هي مثلا the drop راح تكون تقريبا 5.5 كارات. راح ومن هالجهه هي راح نقصها اكشلي ان فيو بيسز هون راح بتطلع منها around diamond you can see actually the point already وبيطلع شيء مدور من هون هي من هالحبه بيطلع ثلاث حبوب uh, a pear shape يعني you know, a drop that's like this diamond هلا I'll show you a few stones actually let me this is how 
actually I'll, I'll show you Hala with the camera. But we have a uh, drop, a round diamond, and a uh, small cushion. We have a 12 carat in total, and this is stone 21. And usually, what happens is that to cut it, first we cut it, for example, if we need to cut it in three diamonds, we cut it with a laser into three. And then, everything is done with the hand. We have in Belgium, in a very traditional method. And you have a disc that rotates very quickly. And we put diamond powders to cut the diamond. Because is the strongest substance in the world. And only a diamond can cut a diamond. So, uh, so that's how we cut a diamond, actually. And, uh, uh, Salah, when I come to Belgium, you have to take me to, them, uh, to, to uh, the, where you do the whole... Uh, all this of course, magic. I'll show you the factory and I'm everything. I'm excited. Well, like, uh, uh, I'll come for that. You want me to show you different... I prepared some shapes to show yeah, you yeah, how a Polish diamond looks. And to show you the different shape, let me just switch the camera one second. Okay. So, these are all type of different shapes. Masan, this is the round diamond. I don't know if you can feel. I see it. This is, for example, a cushion cut. This is an oval. This is actually a yellow diamond. This is a 15 carat oval. That's how it looks. So, this is all type of so, Elna, round. Oh, a cushion, oval. This is pear shape, like I'm talking about now. It's like mm. a drop. I'm a pear. This is emerald cut, so it's like a mirror effect. It was popular like in the 20s and 30s during the Art Deco period. Yeah. This is what we call a marquise. Marquise was a cut created in uh, France many centuries ago. It's, it's quite beautiful in rings. This is cushion we show. This is heart, a very small one. In terms of colored diamonds, and I showed you, so this is how a yellow diamond looks. actually. You have a lot of yellow. Yeah, exactly. Uh, yeah, we do. do Ashin, it's the special. Actually, our specialty here, actually, all Muslim love one, and obviously white diamonds. This is a pink diamond. This is a beautiful one. How do you this compare a, it, Masalan? This is two. This is, uh, this is, you remember I told you the mine Zimi in Sierra Leone, you see how yellow it is? Yeah, it's very. as strong as it can be. And if you compare it to other yellow, this is a fancy yellow. If you see the difference in uh, color, this is vivid, but it's very intense, you see a huge difference. Big difference. This is the last time in Sierra Leone and the Bagin. The Bagin is actually from Africa, South Africa, uh, Botswana, Lesotho. Uh, mostly in Africa, actually, all of them. This actually, in terms of the whites are quite big, and you're talking this is like a 20 plus carat, 20 plus carat. This is also like a 15. These, like this, for example, is uh, this pink, yellow, It's much because of uh, it's this pink is as expensive as this one, Masala, and you see the difference in uh, in size. So um, so yeah, these are the different type of shapes basically uh, that you can find. When we do Masala uh, necklace jewelry making, do you want me to explain about that? Yeah, yeah. I got the sword. I'm gonna put the snap on it. But tell me, um, the uh, process of jewelry making. I will say, tell me, and I, I was told by, you told me actually before that uh, why uh, that Antwerp is called the, the diamond capital of the world. Lish. Mazbut. Hala, Masa, Nahna, the headquarters of Sabana, in Antwerp, in Belgium. He Antwerp, the second largest city in Belgium. He in the 15th and to the 18th century, it had a golden age. And it used to be the most famous city in the world in terms of Uh, trading in general, and we had the biggest port in the world. So here it always had, it's, it's always been a merchant city. Who, uh, the first cutters of diamonds, were in Belgium for big stones. And then the government changed the 80% of the world's 
يعني المباع والشراء تبع الالماز بينعمل هون الماكينه البلجيكي 80% يعني 80 مليون من الماز العالم كله سو اول ذا ماينرز من العالم كله يعني الحبوب يجوا من افريقيا من استراليا من البرازيل من تنز... من روسيا كلهم والمباع والشراء بينعمل هون واكبر حبوب من هون بيروحوا بعدين على اذر بليس بالعالم الحبوب الكبيره مقصن هون مثلا الحبوب الصغيره ولور كواليتي بالهند وبالسين وبتايلاند والحبوب المهم ببلجيكا ونيويورك ودبي كمان اسوا لك شو Um, I wanted to ask you: Do you deal with other gemstones, or which, uh, uh, if yes, with, what what gemstones do you deal with? Uh, emeralds, rubies. What other uh, gemstones do you deal with? Yeah, هلا نحنا مش ما take specialty of the house is uh, diamonds, but obviously, سلّا زمان بهالشغل وعنا علاقات قوية with other uh, cutters and miners uh, بالعالم in other type of gemstones. So we deal mostly in uh, emeralds, whether Colombian or uh, Zambian. Uh, sapphires from Sila and Kashmir, rubies from Mozambique and Burma, and Paraiba from Brazil and uh, Mozambique. Okay. So, uh, I'm really liking your field. I should have not been in clothing, I should have been in jewelry. <laughs> Yalla. <laughs> let's, let's do something together. I was sitting with a friend of mine, when I was looking at you, I was like, I'm not retail. I said, a friend of mine gave me this thing in a long time. But it's a very fascinating subject. And I and you were both in We were both in fine. Um, I guess we've always been switching. Uh, another thing about it, the hin, um, Uh, do you have ready-made them? Uh, you have a wedding? Yeah. I'll show you a necklace that we're building at the moment, which actually mm-hmm. can, can facilitate the process of making uh, a piece. Like I said, there are a lot of things on the table. The way we make the spoon, we're going to send it to the mood board, or he's going to send it to the mood board. We understand what he likes, what he likes, and so forth. We have a sketcher. Uh, that draws the design and do a design. Lehue Badem Namelo Yana Amais client who according to the budget of the client or the quality of the of the client. And sometimes we rock his boom be shuf she had bo beskilo di flawless. Umandul budget masala di flawless, but do she well akbar, but in lower quality and he wants a twist and a change. So literally we create any type of piece. And at the moment we're working on a choker which is all round, and I'll show you. نحن بعد ما نتفق مع الزبون على الديزاين والسكتشز وي ستارت جاذرينج ذا ستون وان باي وان اللي بنعمله بعدين بنحطهم على واكس بيفور جيفينغ ات تو ذا ورك شوب وذيس بروسيس كان تيك سم تايمز ليه عشان نختار كل حبه وحده وحده مش مهم يعني سم تايمز يو جو تو جولرز ذا يوز اني ستون ذا هاف ان ستوك اند ذا ميكس ذا كواليتيز جاست تو سيل ذير ستوك نحن ذا بروسيس از وي بيك افري ستون و ومنرجع نقصهم يعني ليلبقوا على بعض، يعني if you do earrings مش مهم يكون عندك 10 كارات يعني 10 كارات if they're not exactly matching. So مثلا this is a choker we are doing at the moment uh, which is all rounds مثلا it's approximately 100 كارات total weight. The front stones are all 10 كارات. And this is how we put them on wax uh, before sending it to the workshop. This is going to be a beautiful piece. Beautiful. This is a choker on the ribbon. Yes. The ribbon, the choker. It's a choker. Okay, this is 10 and 10 and 10. We'll be about an 8, 6, 5, 4, 3, uh, 2 and all 1 at the back. Hey, beautiful. It's, uh, it's beautiful. It's classic. هلا كقطعة خلصينا مثلا this is the bracelet we just finished uh, last week which, uh, which was made uh, for, for a client it's, it's approximately 90 uh, 90 carats total weight it's beautiful and every stone carat is here 0.4 or 0.5 carat each بس مثل ما شايف يعني في كمية كبيرة عنهم. ايه كمية حلوة. It's uh, this is a ring we did for someone a lot recently as well. It's a 10 carat. كوشن هذه تعتبر هذه؟ كوشن ايه. ايه. ايش 
ستاي ستاي في عندك الكشن هير ولا نعم ايش اكثر شيء في طبع معك هير هي عادة كوشن فير شيب امرود كات راوندز للخاتم اكثر شيء وهلا بعدين يو هاف هارد شيب اكيد فور بندنس ذات كان بي بيوتيفول اور فور فور نيكلس هول هن هلا انا مثلا بيرسونالي لايك راديانت ان وايت دايموندز وي دو لاس اند برنسس كات كمان برنسس كات هو المربع بس ويت بوينتي Uh, corners. Uh, Asher cut kill halukan, it's emerald cut. Ana, one of my favorite is emerald cut, which is this. This is a beautiful one. This is a 10 carat VS2. 10 carat VS2. This is beautiful. And, I got uh, it. <laughs> now. <laughs> And uh, round, I keep, round is quite classic, and it's uh, it's a classic shape that uh, a lot of people like as well. But it's, it's more classic than the rest. But it's always nice as well. This is beautiful, sir. Ali, Hadi, Hadi, it's a piece. Yeah, it's a rare. This is twenty something uh, carat. But tell people now, because you know a lot of people now think that buying diamonds. Because you must be thinking on the one who when he buys these jewelry, this is a luxury. ما يستوعبوا ايش رايك بالفرق بين باينغ طقم وباينغ ا بيس اوف دايموند ذات يو كان اكشلي ريسل ابغى اقول لك اكثر عن هاو شود ذي باي ان دايموند ذات كان بي ان انفستمنت افتر مثلا لازم ينفك هي اهم شيء اهم شيء اهم شيء بس حدا يشرب الماز ويزاوت سينجلينج اوت اني براندز حدا من الواحد يشرب فروم ا براند عشان تدفع بريميوم كثير قويه للبراندنج بالاخر ما تنسى الدايموند هو كوموديتي يعني بالاخر كلهم عنده نفس الشهاده هي شهاده جي اي اي وبالاخر هول سيلر سيلز هيم سيلف تو براندز يعني الواحد اذا بيشتري محل ما مجرد يطلع من المحل خسران نص الحبه مش عشان ذي جوت تريبت اوف بس عشان المحلات از ويل هاف ا لوت اوف هاي كوست ذا جلوبال ماركتنج كامبين اف يو تيك اوف ذا بيج براندز ذا جلوبال شوبس في اوبريشن كوست عالي في براندز ايوه طبعا مزبوط سو so, هي عاده اذا الواحد wants to do it as a smart investment is uh, الواحد يشتري directly from a wholesaler يعني بالاخر there's مثل ما تيك اتس كوموديتي يعني الواحد unless if there's a gold design بس حتى في اني دايموند ديزاين حرام الواحد يدفع براندنج سو so, اذا um, الواحد بده يستثمر بالالماز اي ثينك ذاتس ذا بيست واي تو دو ات اند ات كان بي ا ستورج اوف فاليو especially Is, uh, during these days when prices have dropped. But of course, one doesn't buy the mask today and buy it after a few days. It's a long-term investment uh, and a safe haven. Yeah. Yeah, يعني كثير, مش بس, uh, يعني نحن, we have a lot of clients that are men that buy, that buy it, like, يعني safe haven. Sometimes they buy it in Europe for fiscal reasons, for inheritance tax reasons. يعني you have a lot of different reasons. Uh, that makes it attractive as an investment. Okay, another thing I want to ask, ask you. Okay, about here in Saudi Arabia, so how can people have access to seeing your goods? How do you communicate with them? Yeah, of course. Yeah, of course. Hal, I'm a lot. I'm a. We're the basic book in Belgium, but we have a book in Dubai and London. And I personally. And I live in between London and these two locations. But rather than visit Al Saudi, I have a lot of uh, friends and I add to the area here. And visit Al Saudi, it's about every three to four when you didn't have the COVID situation. Indeed. So, hello. We are for anyone that's interested. Obviously, they can contact us directly. We can have a meeting in Dubai, in Belgium, in Saudi, in Saudi. هونيك uh, and uh, we're always available في, في, everyone is welcome to, uh, to either come on appointment or to نحن بنجي لهم كمان يعني بس نكون بهالبلاد يعني هلا to be honest it's been bad for the last two weeks uh, when everything reopened it's, uh, it's been raining a bit 
بس قبل قبل منا it was amazing يعني we had 25 degrees sun blue skies was amazing 50 degrees here we can't complain exactly ايوه so basically علي انا thank you so much for your time والله صراحه يعني عباره عن بحر معلومات في ناس اللي كانوا مثلا بيشتروا مجوهرات ويقيموا you have Ali's details it's Levuma انا كمان I'm going to put your card, uh, okay. card. Yeah, I'll put it after as well the pay on my Instagram. I'll just be going to them direct access to the end. Thank you. And I'm going to tell you he will understand what you want. He'll understand what you want. He'll give you the price you have a ring in mind. And as he said, the price is nice because his prices are not like, uh, like a wholesaler price, right? Yeah, wholesalers. وكثير براندز اشتروا منه بس هو ما بيقول لانه مؤدب. بس اني ويز ثانك يو سو ماتش فور بينج هير اند ان شاء الله وي دو انذر ون وين يو شو مي مور دايموندز وي ونت فول دايموند سيشن لايف ان شاء الله وين اي سي يو. ثانك يو ثانك يو ندى ثانك يو سي يو على وقتك وجود تو سي يو. يو تو باي. ثانك يو باي باي.